Today, Minecraft released their brand new snapshot on 420, and uh, it's looking a little buggy if you ask me. So let's go ahead and let's check it out, my dudes. All right, so I spawned into this world and uh, yeah, I don't really know what's going on with my textures and my uh, loading here, but um, they seem to be very interesting looking. And uh, yeah, welcome to Snapshot 22W16A. I haven't done a snapshot review in a long time, so let's do a full snapshot review today, my dudes. So the first place we need to visit today is actually the ancient cities and we actually have to look around for these new music disc fragments which is pretty cool so i'm gonna see if they're in here let's just take a little peek all right that's music disc 13 that is not the music disc fragment all right so i managed to find a music disc fragment but not actually in any of the chests but inside of my inventory so basically you take a nine of these bad boys and you make a music disc Samuel Amberg 5. So let's go ahead and check out this brand new music disc. Now, so basically you're gonna be able to find those fragments that I showed you and be able to build this music disc, which is really, really cool. So let's go ahead and grab out a jukebox and let's see what this thing does. Yeah, uh, don't ask what's going on here. I have no clue, but let's hear this new music disc. Oh no. Oh God, not another cursed one. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. All right, well, I don't like this music. This I don't like it. Turn it off. All right, turn it off. Okay, I don't like that music disc. So if you guys want to check out that whole music disc, definitely go check it out. Me, me no like that music disc. That was way too much. Welcome to the home of Minecraft. Uh, here's another new music that we're going to be listening to. Wow, this one's very interesting as well. So there's three new biome-related musics. One is called Ancestry, Airy, Firebugs. Oh, four, sorry. And labyrinth, labyrinth, labyrinth. Yeah, I don't know how to say that. You know, this one's not that bad. It's pretty all right. Definitely go check these out for yourselves. All right, so my world is still glitched out after coming up. Oh my God, what the heck is this thing? After coming down and then coming back up. But uh, yeah, my world's still glitched out. But we still have some more features to check out besides music. Now, I didn't want to show you guys all the music because it's going to be boring for you guys to sit here and just listen to music. But definitely go check them out for yourselves. Um, but next thing, speaking of music, let's turn that down. Next thing we have to look at here is actually the Ally. So let's go pull out the Ally here. The Ally got a little bit of an update. Check them out. Well, there's not actually any physical like appearance update, but uh, they got some cool features coming to them. All right, so originally the ally had only 10 health. Now the ally has 20 health. So he big strong boy, so he's gonna be stronger. You're not gonna be able to kill him as easy. And remember these guys regen really quickly as well. So like, honestly, these guys are gonna be pretty strong, which is kind of a good thing. I like that. It's nice they're making them strong. Wow, my terrain is just messed right up. Now apparently he's gonna have a delay of three seconds instead of five seconds. Um, just to let you guys know. Oh wait, is that a new advancement? Did we not explore that advancement before? I never actually knew that the ally had an advancement. Have an ally deliver items to you. You got a friend of me. That is so cool. So basically there's a little bit uh, less of a delay of him throwing an item to you. As you can see there, that was pretty quick. It used to be five seconds. Now it's only three. Um, that seems a lot quicker than three, but yeah, awesome. Now his item sir train has increased from nine blocks to 32 blocks. Now, that is pretty cool. I got to say, that's going to be obviously a little bit better for us um, because he's going to be able to search from farther away. And then apparently he is now just slower when wandering, which is a just a different movement change. As you can see, he actually is kind of slower. He's just slowly floating around here. But yeah, basically they slowed him down a little bit when he's just wandering, when he has no objective. But one thing they increased, if we go ahead and give him a dirt block. Wow, everything is so glitched out in this world. If we give him a dirt block here and then we get a note block for him, 
Ring a ding ding the note block. I don't know why it just keeps spawning like grass hills. Apparently he's gonna be faster to drop the items off. Come on, prove it, prove it. Okay. Is he only dropping one item at a time? I think, yeah. What are you doing? That is so weird. Okay, there he goes. But yeah, he's gonna be a lot quicker in his movement speed now than he used to be. Probably not a ton of a difference. You're not gonna notice really much of a difference, but a little bit you can actually see. But that's good. So your items aren't gonna despawn while you're doing your thing. All I gotta say is what the heck is going on with this world? This is the glitchiest snapshot I've ever seen. I honestly did nothing to cause this. I, I literally just loaded up the world and, and everything's just being so weird. Look, there's an ally over here. I must have put him there. Like even look at this, like when you go over, over top of the ice. Look, look, it just turns the grass block over here. Can I even break this? Okay, this is just weird. <laughs> we're having a very trippy 420 today. Now, another thing they were actually talking about that I kind of wanted to test, but I can't really manage to get a dropper down here. Um, so basically, they've changed velocity and randomness to the game of Minecraft, which is really cool. And I'm just going to open up this change log for you guys and just read it through with you guys. So it says, uh, some randomized events are now more predictable and no longer have possibility of extreme behaviors. So it says, placement and velocity of things drop by droppers slash dispensers. So... What they mean by this, I'm guessing, is it's just going to be an identical drop every time instead of one maybe shooting out farther than the other. Um, not really sure about that. That's why I was trying to use the droppers. Um, it says placement and velocity of items spawned from containers upon destroyed. Um, so it's basically just saying that it's going to be more predictable and no longer have possible... Oh, my game just crashed. There we go. Um, but anyways, read that change log. Let me know what you guys think about it. Pretty interesting. On that note, have yourself an amazing day, my dudes. And, uh, thank you for joining me with <laughs> for this Minecraft snapshot of 20, 22W16A, where, uh, it crashed at the end. So thank you for joining me. Peace out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know how you like the new snapshot. Me? Uh, I think it's okay. I want to listen to that new music, though.